And now, the HBO comedy special, Quincy Jones, Burning the Light. What do you do as a dying man when you're already following your dreams? I do comedy. And what cancer does is it, it, it changes your perspective of things. Despite being told he only has one year to live, our first guest has faced this devastating news with humor and courage. You fight till you have nothing left, and the chemo will drain you of everything. It'll make you mentally drained, emotionally drained, and then you still have to fight. You were doing a thousand shows a year, is that right? I figured I wanted to be great and average out to three a night. Then you have to keep going even when you don't feel like going. Wow, that is a lot of shows. Mm -hmm. They started a Kickstarter and now it's over $40,000. The comedy community stepped up like big, big time. And they showed you love when you needed it the most. Where is it? Terra Grand Ball. It's, uh, you know, the Monty, well, not you wouldn't know, but okay. in the city. <laughs> it took a lot of baby steps to get to this point right here. HBO is going to air your special. <laughs> there is no cancer when I'm on that stage. There's only me telling my jokes, and that is the moment I'm in. We could deal with the cancer before, we could deal with it after, but on that stage, I'm cancer free. Ladies and gentlemen, Quincy Jones. <laughs>